been busy the last couple of days cutting wood, massive amounts of wood. I'm going to give this pole here to a carver in Canterbury, but we've built some wood boxes for Kristen here. And then moved all of the wood that was outside inside. Another one here. And now we're just sweeping the remnants up and we come up with this really good idea. We've got an old bed mattress that we use to clean weeds out of dirt and we're using that to separate the kindling from the bark and the stones. So we're getting a shitload of kindling. Hi! Out of all this. Good thanks. Um, yeah, it uh, makes it easier for Kristen so she won't have to chop any kindling anymore. There's my ducks. Check this out. It's an underwater drone. See how it's made in voyage, guys. Ooh, sounds fancy. You hook it up, hook an app up to your phone, and it's got a VR headset, and you can also look at it off your phone, I think. VR headset or the phone. I don't know, I haven't read the instructions, I just left that order. Just left that order, Jack. You set the phone to VR mode, put the it's a just a type of headset that you slot the phone into. Alright, here we go. You get it out there if you can. There's a bit of fluffing around with this cable. Oh yeah, that's up and down. Can you go forward? You're sucking all that shit in, bro. Oh, I don't think we can see anything. Is it too dark, too murky in there, is it? Whoa, it's fast. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit, it's real quick. Yeah, I set it to high. That was super quick, wasn't it? Well, we need to get it in some crystal clear water because this lake's just too murky. I was wondering why it was going slow than I remember if I had a second low. Wow, okay, well, interesting first run of the Power Vision. What is it? Ray, Manta Ray. Yeah, power Ray. Power Ray, the Power Vision yeah. Power Ray. Yeah, we're going to have to go to some clear water so we can actually see what the hell we're doing. We've relocated to the pool where we can actually see things and there's no rocks and weeds and ducks swimming around. Jeez. Well, there you have it. Now we just need to go take it somewhere where we can see more and do more adventures. Ah, there's just no rest. It's relentless. Let's get home and then boys ring up. Uh, see you later tomorrow. Let's go fishing. Uh, if I must. Plan for tomorrow, another bluefin tuna. Or three. We'll see. Just gave all the other stuff away too. I've got maybe four more bags in the freezer. And fingers crossed, the forecast is going to be good. It's variable at the moment. Well, different sites are predicting different things. So it could be one meter chop pounding away out there. It could be fine. We'll take a punt, see what happens. Just got on, I've got so much to do. So much I could upload all that video footage and clear the cards and charge cameras and cook dinner and boodling mm -hmm. Bloody hell, the sea legs has been sitting in the back of the seat and it's gone all soggy. We just had to drink the sea legs. Hopefully, we didn't take too much. It's kind of hard to dose correctly when you're drinking it. A few rollers coming in over the Great Bar today, but she's all good. We got a six foot west southwest swell and a ten knot east southeast breeze. So the breeze is pushing into the swell, pushing the waves up. There's some real beautiful surfing waves here. Hopefully we don't get surfed.
sweet jump. A little bit bouncy out here. We spot a trawler off in the distance. Just going to go straight to the trawler, chuck the lures in and start dragging the line. The trawlers work. Found our trawler to get some lines in the water and catch some big fish. Get a bit rolly out here. The reason we pulled up behind the trawler is because they act like a real big burly trail. As they're dragging the net long. There's just bits of fish falling out of the net and also with these bigger trawlers they've actually got onboard processing facilities so they catch the fish, they chop it up and they process it on board which is really handy because then no one knows how much fish they're catching they just make it into fish cakes and then off it goes to McDonald's. Well, we've got our first catch of the day. Caught us a molly mork, unfortunately. eating those things. Fish on! What? Well, that one too. We got a triple on. One's right next to the boat. Ah, he's still going. Just little ones, I think. Awesome. Still on, Jace? Yep. How <laughs> exciting. There was one right next to the boat having a crack at the lures. Just little ones, I think. They might be albacore. Who knows? <laughs> Jack's just winching his one in. A couple of skipjacks, are they? I reckon they must be a little bluefin, hopefully. We shall see. Winch, winch. Oh, he goes. Have I had a rain? Jack and Chili been here, Jackie boy. Pizza fry. Bluefin. Alright, little Southern Pacific bluefin. Whoa. <laughs> Let 
one of them guys. Alright, money in the bag. Alright, Lou's back in the water. Time for a big one. Wow, there's some leader leads on this. Not like yet, mate. Can we get a little bit more accelerator? Five minutes later, fish on again. All right, we're three up. The boy, other boys haven't hooked up yet. Feels better, right? A little bit. Whoa! whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Almost lost the right of the board then. The cap is close. You're right, Jack? There you go, even those little fish can light up when they're next to the boat. Oh, look, they're all back down there, isn't it? Look, Are they? Where are they? Little oh, Finn? Oh. All his mates are following him in. Whoa! Okay. Oh, he's angry this one. Off he goes again. Well, you gawky, bro? No. And that pool almost took a chunk out of Jack then. Good. The gloves make a difference. Look, it did get me. Oh, that's going to be a nice turn. Awesome, we just need a big one now. Come on. These black magic lures are slaying them today. Loving the black magic. Shit, there's some down there. Like that, How eh? many were there? Oh, I only seen a couple, but they were like swimming like with his mate, you know, just coming in. Jack on the leader. Ooh, he's giving it heat. Let me know when you're going to let him go, I want to get a photo. Oh, ready? Get from, can you throw him, pick him up and throw him, like yeah. a trout. Ready? Three, two, oh. one. <laughs> awesome, catch and release. Should we cruise along for a bit so we stop catching these small ones? She slowed down a bit, we've come off the patch of fish. Just driving around trying to find them again. The trawlers have buggered off, they've pulled up and are steaming further north. So instead of following them, we're just gonna concentrate on this patch of fish where we caught the big loof a couple of weeks ago and where we just had the smaller bites. The trawlers have all skedaddled, so we're just going to catch a couple of blue nose. Well, we're going to try on the jig and then we're going to go home. Because I'm actually supposed to be looking after Sunny today. Kristen said, Oh, yeah, sweet, it's okay, but now she can't find a babysitter and I'm in big trouble. I'm in the dog box. Not happy, Jack's using my holocaust braid to catch gemfish on. <laughs> See if it, that chicken will probably catch something on so. 
Any bites, Jack? Any bites? I don't know, what, what kind of technique do you use when you... What's this called? Lazy jigging. <laughs> the Beastmaster 2022 is starting to smoke. Sorry, it's the Gigamax. Gigamax, <laughs> Gigamax. I've got to come up with a better name than that, Shimano. The Gigamax. Fuck this, let's go home. <laughs> Fish even sucks. got to the bottom? I don't know. Probably should have used something heavier than a 30 gram jig. <laughs> a couple of blue nose would have been good to take home. Mm. Could have given it a decent attempt. We shouldn't let those other bluefin go. We could have had a bluefin each. We're like, ah, oh, we're going to catch a massive one soon. We'll just let these little pups go. <laughs> Might have one last troll and then we'll shoot for home while it's glassy so we don't have to pound our way back in for two and a half hours. I feel some Russian dancing music coming on. <laughs> Chicken got eaten. Chicken pickle gone. So more than likely fell off. Notorious stream out bars looking pretty good today. Great day on the water. Didn't get the big fish we were after, but we got a couple of little ones, so that's all right. Pretty awesome. Thanks for the tuna. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> couple of tuna in the chili but not the big massive 150 cat. Oi, get down you mongrel. <coughs> not the massive one we were expecting but we got rid of another puppy. See ya mate. In the dog box, towing the dog box. Jason's going to take it up, give it a service and I'm going to pick it up in a couple of weeks. Out the gate. Just lose the dog box for a while. Hopefully Jace gives it back. <laughs> 